What is up, fellow streamers? And not streamers. Maybe VOD watchers. Who knows? VOD enthusiasts. We are once again jumping into Genshin in the end. I felt like Zandless, but also I'm like, you know what? Let's do Genshin. <laughs> yeah, we'll get to Zenless as well soon. I feel like maybe until Natlan is released, we'll play like Genshin. Then I will stop. Because, well, I have not progressed the Archon quest at all. So, yeah. Here is where I, I'm a pain. I want world quests first to be completed. Then I'm thinking, okay, okay, let's see to our conquest. Yeah. Yeah. I'm weird like that. Or maybe not weird. I just feel like side stuff should be done first and the main stuff later. I'm that kind of person. Life. Anyhow, we are almost at 100 followers, funnily enough. Um, where this goes by we I mean me and everyone who follows obviously I don't refer to myself as a multiple people no mm. all right the music stopped we might as well jump to the game might as well jump here volume up and we have a quest uh, close to New Fontaine Research Institute so we are going to go right there there he is Brogli hydrology researcher mm. interesting what's up mate what is up Ah, uh, what am I to do? Hey, uh, are you okay? Sighing so sadly alone by the water like that? Did something bad happen? Yeah. And it wasn't any old something bad, but something awful. Ah, uh, apologies, I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Broglie, and I'm an entry-level researcher at the Fontaine Research Institute. And I was previously responsible for monitoring Fontaine's hydrology data. Eh, uh, what's hydrology data? Uh, data about hydrolo... hydro... Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Simple put, it is the data related to the various properties of water. For example, there is a temperature of various water layers, water level, rates of current flow and evaporation, within set times, concentration of dissolved impurities, and so on and so on. Whoa, that all sounds really complicated! It is. That's why people are needed, specifically my colleagues and I, to collect this complex data and make observations so that we can detect changes in their water quality in advance. My dog just jumped out, jumped down from the bed and crawled underneath it. <laughs> If no one does this work, by the time we discover a huge problem, it will be too late to address it. You know, that's one of the reasons those lovely Oceanids left Fontaine. I might know a few of them. There was a change in water quality that made it unsuitable for them to live in. Really? That's not what I heard. Well, that's what I was told during my induction training. Probably to rouse a semblance of personal responsibility in us. The point is, monitoring the hydrology data is pretty important work. For instance, if a, a change in water quality nears the minimum coefficient, it could make taste less smooth and refreshing. Mm, not really a fun fact. Top water in Poland, absolutely safe to drink, supposedly. I still feel grateful. Yeah. I also still buy bottled water. <laughs> what? That's all? <laughs> Why 
Well, that's what makes it the minimum coefficient, right? But if things go out of hand. What? What the water turn into Fonta? That would be terrible. Fonta is disgusting. Actually, Fonta in Fontaine, or maybe it's good. Fonta in our world? Ew. I don't get why it's so popular. I really don't. If you want something orange flavored, just drink Mirin Daman. It's so much better. No, it will probably just lead to a mass extinction event all over Fontaine. Scary! Wait a minute, does that mean you're assigning here? Be by yourself because something terrible had happened to the water? Eh? Oh, no, 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 no. Not at all. It's just that the monitoring data gathered have sunk to the bottom along with the observation station. Huh? And I don't know how I can fish them back out. That's what's got me so worried. And observation station too? Yeah, I imagine you've heard about the awful act lab accident from before. You know, the one that blew the central laboratory sky high? <laughs> we might have... Yeah, participated in helping with... Dealing with that. As ill luck would have it. I bet this event would not trigger. Or should I say this quest would not trigger. Or it shouldn't basically trigger unless we completed that thing. Unless it refers to the first explosion which we have not participated in. Anyway, as ill luck would have it, the lab accident also sank the hydrology observation station here. Fortunately, my colleagues and I were doing study somewhere else at the time, so we weren't hurt. But the years of hydrology monitoring data we've coll collated are still down there. Well, does this... That, that does seem quite serious. We'll take care of it. Eh? Really? Ah! Kind lady, if you can help me, I'll be in your debt for the rest of my life. You should know that ever since the observation station sunk, the former departments had to be reorganized and it was transferred to the newly established Department of Hydrology and Aquatic Life Conservation. Not only is the department head briefing down my neck all day, but there are all these new inexplicable rules. We have to report for duty on time. You say that, I imagine this is not on time, but the kind of thing. You better arrive 15 minutes early. No. I'm not getting paid for those 15 minutes. And we still have to make this weekly report at the end of the week. A uh, week. Hmm. We can't even open and take our afternoon naps in the office anymore. Ooh. Sort of best part up about remote work. You have nothing better to do. Or you're finished with your tasks. Nap it is. Even worse, there is a one who keeps a blubber beast in the office. A blubber beast! It's bitten me three times already! Free! It's a hat trick! So if our research data from before can be retrieved, I'll be able to think of a way to persuade my supervisor to restore my hydrology monitoring department. That way my colleagues and I can also be transferred to back to our original post and return to happy lives of ease. Hey? Uh, um, I mean, return to fulfilling lives of field studies. So after all that, you just want to slack off, don't you? I mean, it's work, come on. Yeah, why don't you just go down there and get that stuff yourself? Oh, Paimon be like... Yeah, well, this is embarrassing, but even for the Fontaine Research Institute did organize diving training sessions, we strategically held the dinner each time. I mean, every diving training session conflicted with our dinner reservation at the Hotel de Beau. What a shame. You can't swim, can you? I don't worry, I understand, man. I can't swim either, so... How would I participate in diving training if I can't swim to begin with? <laughs> anyway, the advancement of the science of hydrology and the... Sorry. And the future of Fontaine are in your hands, kind lady. As for the reward, worry not. As long as you can help me recover my research, I'll do everything in my power to ensure you're adequately compensated. So I'm begging you, please retrieve our precious data from the central control room for me. Control room? Control room? Can I even get to the control room? Wait, wait, no, no, I kinda want to jump from here, I'm not gonna lie. 
Yuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuu
Hello. Great, now we can turn the console on. What does the instruction manual say? Okay, next we just need to pull that lever that says do not touch under any circumstances on it and we can export the recorded data. Do not touch under any circumstances. That's what the manual says. Paimon guesses the to prevent other people from misusing it, weird. You pulled the lever. After some rumbling, the machine in the machine spits out the paper. There should be monitoring data, Broglie needs. Nice, old style. Punched tape retrieved from the water. The data recorded within can only be designed for using specialized machinery. All of it was made of special waterproof material and hence tooth not yet been destroyed. It's been in there long enough to still feel what rather wet even after being hauled out. Also we are underwater, so of course it will feel No. Paimon can understand all of it, but all we need to bring back is to bring it back to him. We're good, right? I guess so, Paimon. I guess so. Hmm. Wait. Oh. For a second I thought it shut down all the... Uh, exits now. After all, we got the electricity back. Whoa! Ooh, nice. What's up, man? Yeah, that's it, that's it. All the data from the station will be covered now. Well, that's good. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did you say this station? Yeah, we have three observation stations and one central processing station in total. Each with their known independent data sets. So in order to convey the needs for monitoring to my supervisor, the data from the remaining two stations still needs to be recovered and then analyzed at the central processing station. Ah, <sighs> or mine. Paimon will bite. Do you also need us to salvage the other two stations? Oh, of course not. The other two observation stations were spared from the lab disaster and continue to stand proudly on solid ground. That's a relief. It's just that those two have been taken over by some fellows from Shneznaya. <laughs> Hang on, you're not talking about full two, are you? Yeah, that's them. They claim that they got permission from the Maison Gestion to take over the stations. They won't let us anywhere near them, let alone retrieve the data. As for the Maison Gestion, as you may know, verifying anything with the Maison Gestion is harder than trying to catch lightning in a bottle. Sounds suspicious. Yeah, since it's a fool to you were talking about, they might actually be planning to use the observation stations to do something bad. Paimon doesn't want... super want to help, but... <sighs> Lumina, we should take a look just in case. Thanks so much, kind lady. I'll mark the locations of the Pate de Fruit station and Crepes Suzette station on your map now. Aren't these all food names? Yeah, and they do sound sweet and tasty, don't they? Just the way life ought to be. By the way, this place is the Conch Mandelain station. Imagine if you would breaking off a small piece of Conch Mandelain, stepping in warm water of Tortisane and drinking it all up. That's what our tea times were like. Ah. I never thought the station would end up sinking like this. Anyway, for me to be happy and free again, I mean, for scientific development, advancement, and the future of humanity, I'm counting on to help me recover the old monitoring data. This guy. Hey, wait, wait, wait a minute. Now that Pymo's looking at these locations, it seems like we've already been there to them before. Huh? Really? Yeah, we already sent those full to running for the hills. And we already have the data you're looking for. Coincidentally. Oh, oh, oh yeah, this is it, this is it. You two are angels. Angels sent from the heavens to save me from my misery and turn to my happy life of... Hey, what about that style and stuff? Anyway, there is time to turn loose, kind lady. Please come with me to the Fontaine Research Institute to find my supervisor and request the key to the central processing station. Do... do I have this? <sighs> I mean, at least I'm done with this stuff. <laughs> um... It's probably this. 
Yeah. I think at least. Yeah, in search of lost time. Got it. Supposedly there will be one more quest. Hmm. <laughs> so technically we are getting into the second world quest zone. Lady, you are finally here. I have the key, now we just have to go to the central processing station to organize the data. And then we can start the hard logical monitoring again. And we have to go with you? Considering the situation of Pate de Fruit and Krebs de Suzette stations, it is possible that those fellows from Shazaya are also at the central processing station. So please come with me! Don't forget to compensate us! Yeah... Money, money, money. Oh yeah, I've been there before. To get some... stuff. Didn't I kick their asses over here as well? <laughs> I mean to take chests and so on, obviously. I don't remember there being full to over here for. But who knows? Those cockroaches can be anywhere. Here we are, lady. This is a central processing station where our hydrology research data is analyzed. Looks like it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't have a full to you. We're not needed, right? We can be sure yet. What if there are soldiers from their Snesnaya inside? I might not be able to see Conch Madeleine again. <clears throat> I mean, I shan't ever conduct hydrological research again. Please go inside with me. Fine, just open the door. I see a chest over there that I want to open myself. Hmm. Okay, just more. Uh, I'll take that. Luxurious chest. Hmm, tasty. <laughs> I love opening a good, luxurious chest from time to time. I have ten more to open. Wait, that's not the one that's on the map. What the fuck? This is something completely different described over here. Whatever. I guess we go down. Whoa! I did not expect that. Examine the central processing station. Alright. Let me see. If we can put together the collected data, Recon will get some significant results. And hydrological monitoring should resume very soon. I can't wait. That sounds great. Why do I get this feeling that we're missing part of the data? Am I just paranoid? Why are you so unsure? Aren't you in charge of the data? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I got the wrong room. The Fatui commander leaves the scene at a speed that does not match his physique. Wait, did something just pass us by? He was faster than a bishop. Wait, that's not the point. He's a Fatus. Why is he here? Lumine. We need to go after him and get to the bottom of this. In a way, I agree. You know what? We need a fire. We need a fire. Because that was... Uh, the cry of Atus, I believe. Where is that bastard? Stop chasing me! I've lo locked all the dolls! You can't get in! <sighs> we'll see about that. Hmm. 
All right. We need this power. Maybe here. I mean, I can't really transfer it anywhere else, so... I feel like this one is something I can pick up. Yeah. And now we drop it here, I guess. Now we do this. And, well, I guess we go here. <laughs> Let me borrow your power. Okay, so... I cannot really go anywhere from here, it seems. Gotcha. I need to pick this up. What can I say? I just need to. If there is an option to pick something up, you just do. Come on, mark it. Why are you not marking it? Thank you. There's... what the heck? What's that? Oh, would you look at that? I managed to open the door. Oh, it's an otter. Okay. That's cool. Hello. That... what the fuck? That's him? Also, why did my power go away? Let's fight. You're an awful. No, I'm not. Where'd you go? Hide and seek. I mean, where would you hide, you punk? Are you upstairs? Oh no, you're a Hydro, aren't you? Yeah. Got him. Auto options, Fatu Commander jumps in the water. Again? <sighs> this punk closed the door! Can't we just open it from here? No? open now. Nope. That's all I have to do is just go here and... Woo! Where is he? Malinowski, I know you're here. Oh, he opened the path? It sure looks that way. Hello! Great speedy boy, you don't have a chance over here, come on. Ah, 
I still by surrender. Stop. You're here for the paper tips, right? You can have them all. Just stop attacking me. Is that... Is that all, Broglie? Hmm. Well, maybe, yeah. This should be all of it. Sure. Just forget it by mask. What's your objective here? Yeah, tell us everything. Why are you occupying the stations? I... To slack off. Hey? I'm Malinowski, commanding officer of the 34th Independent Investigative Squad. I, I, at first, when we had just been dispatched to Fontaine, everyone was quite happy, and the mission wasn't that difficult. So what does that have to do with occupying the stations? A few months ago, due to some organization changes, headquarters signed someone named Shumilov as my new deputy. Shumilov, right. The plot leader we saw at the Krepes Suzette station. Yeah, that's the one. I can't stand that fellow, but I can't get rid of him, so I look for excuses and go on missions to get away from him. Wait, I was confused. You said that he's your deputy, right? Yeah, yeah. So are you his superior? Why do you have to listen to him? Well, he... I um, blast him, but he always acts seriously and makes Hodder do the work. His words are hard to refute, and I can't very well tell him that no one here wants to work in front of everyone, can I? It just so happened I saw some strange towers nearby, so I told him that we are going to investigate and forge the letters from Mason and Gestion. So you forged the documents? Paimon knew it. There was no way that the Mice and Gestion would let you manage the hydrological monitoring stations. <laughs> Any other questions, Brogil? Or should I say Brogili? I see, I see. So you're just trying to slack off. No, I mean, you're just trying to get a little piece of the in this noisy world by combining our monitoring stations. Well, how would you rate our recommendations? Hey! Hey, very comfortable. Scenery nearby is beautiful. Two, usually feel a lot better after taking a short, taking a short nap. Right. Especially when you wake up and realize that there are no urgent tasks. And that you're not being watched by someone you don't like. You can just enjoy the afternoon sun and the breeze. It's like waking up from a dream and drink another where you don't have to worry about anything. That's how you respond. You're supposed to live. It's a shame that you haven't tried the limited edition black tea in the Vasari Passage. If you get a chance... Wait, where is this conversation going? What the heck? Anyway, please come with us. It's time to let the Fontaine Research Institute know what you've done. Uh... Wait. Uh, he actually didn't cause any damage to our research, did he? Objectively speaking, he even collected some data for us. He's just someone who wants to be rid of work and live a comfortable life. Yeah... That's right. Wait, that's not something to be proud of, even when you put it like that. Kind lady, please let him go in the name of science. <sighs> Is this really related to science? Thank you, sir. And the two of you, I swear I'll never do such thing again. I'll do my best to slack off on my own. I love how determined you are. Can you get not get hyped up over something like this? Yeah, in a way. I mean, on the other hand, if you do work that you don't enjoy, kind of understandable. <sighs> With that result, I'll be going back to go through the data. Thank you for your work. Please take this. Is it really result? Whatever, at least the stations are operational again. And the full two platoons have left. I must suppose it's over. Maybe it is. And maybe it isn't. You can never predict. Kind of. Alright, let's see if maybe in the Institute that other quest triggered. Oh, I think not. Nope. Doesn't look like it. So we have to go and run to here now to find out if maybe I can go and do... I think I will not be able to do that one. I said we have to go here, but I, you don't know where exactly to be fair, given that I was looking only at the interactive map. But yeah, I do believe I will not be a... or maybe? If I go here... The entrance is here. Hmm. I 
I'm not sure now. Can I enter this place at all? Yes, I can. But it's only going upwards, so that's the issue. And I do believe what I need to do is go downwards. Might as well collect some of that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. enough artifacts. Hmm. <laughs> I do not remember how to get there. But based on the fact that uh, I have this kind of unlocked, I should be able to get there. Maybe from here? No. From here? Hmm. I wonder if I could go from here higher over here. Yeah, I mean, it looks like that, at least. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. <laughs> Oh yeah, I remember this place. Sort of. We've done some quests over here, but... I don't think we've done the, the one I'm kind of after right now. So the quest is around here. So I have to go to the left and then jump down here or something. I didn't want to. <laughs> I think we are jumping down here or going up here. We are going up. <laughs> well, they didn't go as I wanted it. Hmm. Maybe we're going down there. Yep. One area here. I would like to go this sign but it seems like I cannot okay I think elevator then was it an elevator here yeah <sighs> stream labs it's time to wake her up
Yellen is beautiful. What a beauty. Yellen. Well, in my opinion at least, when it comes to Liyue, best looking character. And in general my favorite. Even for his Liyue is filled with so many good characters. And so many good looking characters. Come on. Ningguang, Beido, Kachin, Shene. And so on and so on. Alright, where is the passage? Hmm. I think we are at the location right now. Maybe. Yeah, like by the boxes. Where is this guy? Bricola. You're back, and so I am. I asked to uh, I was asked to access the area. Ah, very familiar somehow. I remember that there was a period of time where when the administrative officer was very big on getting everyone to do diving training. I personally think that's all it's all rather pointless. But work is work, I suppose, and the mission is a mission. Uh, I've placed a few replica anchors in the area. Don't worry if there are just dummies. The content of the current training is to retrieve all the anchors inside the building within the time limit. This is it actually, I think. Would you like to give it a go? I can give you some cons compensation for Turkey, but you'll be assisting research after all. Sure. Alright, I'll time you. Don't forget, you need to leave all anchors inside the building within time limit. And don't find me. Let me move. Five minutes. Yeah, but w where are they? Dude, but... Where are they? Dude, I'm cheating, I don't care. I'm not searching for something with a time limiter. Not a chance. Uh, Anchor... Anchor, okay. Genshin for anchors. I'm... Okay, the first one is somewhere in here. Whoosh. Got it. The second one is... On a lower level. That is a little problematic then. If it's on a lower level. Oh sh shit. Um can I retrieve it anyway somehow? No. Wait, that's not here. Shut the matter. Yeah, 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 I need... To wait. That, that's not the order you were... <laughs> ...dropping... Yes! Thank you. What is the fourth one, then? Fourth one is... 
Okay, also here, got it. So I still need to drop down. In a way, it would be better if there was no elevator now. We would jump down, would be so much faster. I wonder how come she doesn't get a new outfit. I mean, Ferris is already epic in a way. Wait. I should be lower. What the hell? I am. Good. Got it, and I still need to go a little further here somewhere. I don't need to return to him in that time. I thought I had to return to him in that time as well. Ah, then I cheated for nothing. I didn't have to cheat for the locations in that game. Whatever. Why is the elevator not here? What the heck? <sighs> road to Singularity. I don't even remember a road. What was Road to Singularity? It's a world quest, yeah, I know. Oh, okay. It was in this specific area. A quest as well. With that other guy. With the guy that locked us up in... In the place. Yeah, I remember this. Now I do. Sometimes it's a cheese dude questline. Certain stump. have that weird pain in the ear. I just had it right now. Ah. Yeah. Where is that punk? <laughs> Oh, you got it. Looks like this change is impossible. After all, I guess I can submit this proposal to the Institute. Saying that I haven't finished checking all the assets yet, so I'll have to come back here later. But regardless, thanks for your help. Ah, yes, and here's your reward. Safe travels now. Hmm, 20. I mean, not terrible. Better than nothing, obviously. 
better than nothing. Okay. Supposedly somewhere in here. But I don't think this one will trigger. Unless I've already done that. I think my, I might have done this one to be honest. Or maybe not. I don't know. So we'll go a little further. Our purpose is in another canal. Let's... This area also seems like I've been here, to be honest. I feel like I've done something over here. What's up, man? Why waste your time on all that and I this work and when there is others who can help? About this pier. Fortress. Pipeline. Reapers. Blah, blah, blah. I think I completed this one, to be honest. I remember being here and doing something. Let's have a look. Uh, our purpose is in another canal. Our purpose is in another canal. Yeah, I think I've done it. Is there an achievement for this? It would be so much easier if they added um, the list of completed achievements, or should I say completed quests, into the game. Achievement, let's see. But I feel like I've done this, to be honest. Yeah. I remember repairing something. Hmm. I'll leave it for now. I'll not be marking that one. So I still think I've completed this. Boop. 951 achievements. Yeah. How do we wish this wise now? 111. Nice. How long until... Three days. Nice. Okay. Um, dude, I don't want to enter Cord de Fontaine yet. I'm not gonna lie. This is everything underwater. So I don't know if we should go there. Let's go here first. This one we might have done. Go downstairs. Defeat the mecha. Fontaine Institute Chronicles World Quest. I don't remember doing that. Yeah, this guy. He's the same guy. We've done this, kind of. Talk to the guy. When will I be able to start working at the Institute again? Uh, are you still working here? Oh, yeah, so happy to see you. Take a seat. I'll make some coffee. I drank all the coffee. I guess I'll have to pour you some water. I'm continuing my qualifications review work. Do you have coffee to drink here? Of course! Official Institute Satellite Office after all. Blah, blah, blah. Thanks for the artifacts if you have any here. No, you don't. <sighs> You do. Oh yeah, this place. How the heck do I get there? There's gotta be a way, man. Hmm. 
Hmm. Alright, let me see if I can get there from here. Doesn't look like it. What else? We'll go here now, here now, somewhere in here. Okay, like here. Okay. That didn't work as I planned it to. But it's fine. Good stuff, but terrible taste. Light up the hydro monuments and rearrange them. Get rid of the slime first. Because when I open the chest, it will probably trigger a cutscene. I knew it. <sighs> Paimon can't stand how those objects look. Somehow it reminds Paimon of those ugly things we saw last time. Why is the Hydro Monument buried underground? Paimon doesn't get it. You mean I should be re Just like how Salsa taught us? Oh yeah, that's something I've been doing. Like... Outside... Lift. Outside of the streams. When I was collecting the chests. Phew, this looks so much better. Salsa would be proud of us if you saw this. Don't you think so, Traveler? Lumina? Robbers! A robbery in broad daylight! Eh? Robbers? Where? I'm talking about you two, not only to destroy my masterpiece. Kavech? Reject. You even took the chest! Ooh. Wait, it's the evil green guy! So it really was the work of an adventurer's guild member. What work on earth? I should be asking you guys what you did. So these ugly things are your masterpieces, huh? G the audacity! What do you mean ugly things? Haven't you heard of installation art? Looks like Fontaine's art education still has a long long way to go. Oh, but you do don't look like you're from Fontaine. That's because we are not from Fontaine! Paimon's Paimon! She's Lumine! We are also members of Ventures Guild! <laughs> we are members of the organization! I feel evil! <laughs> Hello there, buddy. Why would you even call somebody body when you don't even know the name? I'm Ubu! <sighs> An adventurer installation artist. Seeing how you guys are making zero sense, I'm guessing you're uh, often up to crazy shiny guns. I won't pursue this matter this time. Hey, actually... What? I need to restore the work, so if you want to say thank you, do it quickly. I have nothing to thank you for, but I sure have million things I want to yell at you for. S Salsa? With me around, you don't have to be scared, Paimon. Evil green guy, we've destroyed all of the traps laid by you. Stop trying to ruin our beautiful Fontaine with your sinister traps. Wait, 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 destroy all, you destroyed all of my artworks. Hey, we didn't exactly destroy them. We just rearranged them so to suit the surrounding scenery. You, you brats and plebeians, how could you hope to understand art, to tell my installation art, my works in something so mediocre and mundane? But is it really art? Paimon doesn't know much about it, but can you really call something that looks so out of place art? Huh? Can you? Yeah, of course, the boundaries of the art are set by the artist. A work created by an artist is naturally called a work of art. Who is the artist? It is I, Ubu, the extraordinary installation artist. 
<laughs> in ca that case, as the founder of the Alliance of Artists to overthrow the evil organization to protect the future of Fontaine, I declare that I do not recognize it as an art. Overthrow the... Uh, what? Overthrow the evil organization. It refers to adventurous guild that is ru ruining the scenery with an installation art. What a joke, I've never heard of such an lens. Kid, what gives you the right to say that my work is in art? I'm a painter, so you could say I'm an artist. Of course, I'm qualified. Uh, look, kid, being an artist isn't some child's play. You can't say you're an artist just because you want to become one. You gotta have works that are recognized by people. Dude, I mean... Nobody recognizes your stuff. So what makes you qualified, huh? Your work is the installation art you speak of. These evil traps? Do people clap when they see them? No. That's because there are too many plebeians who can't comprehend the charm of my words. The uh, true art is always at least understood and the least and... Yeah... Simply put, no one understands at all. You should start from making art that people can actually understand you, punk. Yeah, if no one understands it, it's either too avant-garde or simply... Garbage. No, it can't be. My works are perfect. There is absolutely nothing wrong with them. You guys just don't understand. People just don't understand it. Darn it, I'm not giving up. This isn't over. Who knows? What a stubborn enemy. But I'm not giving up either. The future of Fontaine's art rests on my shoulders. We all have a goal to work towards. Is this a good thing? It probably is right, right? Salsa, you're still around. Hello, Lumin and Paimon. Do you manage to recruit a new members? I found prospective members who were willing to participate, but I need to carry out a rigorous assessment to make sure they have the right qualifications. After all, Fontaine's future is at stake. Yeah, the other, uh, the other talk. Not rushing home today. I finished my homework, so I thought I can get out longer before heading home. Cool. Salsa. Salsa, salsa. She's a good girl. I bet she will get... Um, I mean, if it was up to me, I would give her a vision at some point. Mm. According to the data, eventually something will be happening here. But not now. One over here, yeah. What about this one? <sighs> huh. Nothing is happening over here. Well, I guess we'll go here then. Yep. <laughs> to this guy. Whose garden, garden I entered multiple times. And multiple times I was stopped by him as well because he had a problem with me doing that. Hmm. Villains, you recalorant villains. That's right, run, run far, far away, to the other side of the mountain, to see the alleys, make sure I don't see you. Wow, what's going on? Huh, <laughs> nothing serious. Hero, run away again. It happens all the time. Just say the word inspection, all of heroes take off. This time, Prince and Princess fled, too. Had I not tripped when they got off the flower field previously, leaving me with the yet unhealed leg injury, dealing with those three rascals would be easy. Are you mountaineers? If you'd like a place to rest your feet, you can sit a while in the house. I shall treat you a bit once I have brought those three rapscallions back by their scruffs. Yeah, and we have vowed to conquer every high peak in Teyvat. Wait, we've... we vowed that? Paimon definitely wasn't consulted. Well, let's introduce ourselves all the same. Paimon's Paimon, she's Lumina. We're adventurous and if you're looking for people, there is no more 
No one more experienced than us. If your legs aren't feeling too good, leave the searching to us. Adventurers? Hmm. Then why don't you wear those green uniforms? Because they are ugly? And we are so much better? Not everyone has to wear that outfit. Rather, we're such experienced adventurers that we can just wear whatever we want. I see, I see. I suppose the service of the seasoned adventurers should also come with the requisite payment. Alright then, good children, call me Earnshaw. I would be most grateful for your help. So we're looking for hero, prince and princess. This doesn't sound like normal names. Are these nicknames for kids or...? They're dogs. Hey? Really? They sound like rather kiddie names, man. My daughter named them. If it was not for raising hue and cry, I would not have raised such a delicate creatures. When they were still pups, they were quite silly and rather cute. But they quickly grew disobedient. Little rascals. Try to control them a little and ah, they resist and they flee. They don't go very far, of course, but one does need to retrieve them all the same. Ah, for a hero to fear something like tooth inspection. What a joke. When they come back once they get hungry, they'll probably just play until sundown before returning. Or they... Or they might awaken the wild spirit in their blood, return to the mountain forests and become apex predators. That would be a cool story, huh? No, no, no. Rules must remain rules. If we let them off once, they will do this a second and third time. And once they get used to doing it, they will not change for the better easily. But they're just little doggies, aren't they? Do we really have to be strict with them? Well, they do have a bad example to follow. That silly daughter of mine left home several years ago and hasn't returned. Well, if I had done exactly as she had, they would have saved me some time. But if he... If she were to return and find her precious dogs, whom she raised hell just to own, gone she'd bowl for all she's worth, even for this all her fault anyway. <sighs> Sounds like we walk into family issue, better not to, best not to ask further. Alright then, so we just need to bring them back home, right? Yeah, yeah, the forests are dangerous, and get even more so at night. These dogs do not know how delicate they are, even if they do not love it, they are safer in here. Heroes run off to the north. For no dog to still be so playful, seriously. It also like posing to forage for food along the path. Don't go easy on it, it'll get in real trouble if it eats something bad. If it refuses to leave, harden your heart and take the food it got from Archon knows where anyway. That should give it a sign that it's time to go home. The other two haven't gone far, they're just mocking about in the flower garden. Just tell them to go back here and that should do it. Well, this sounds simple, just leave it to us. You just wait here and show, we'll be right back. Careful about the flowers, by the way. Don't tread on them. Yeah, I know. Do do, get check. Don't tread the flowers. Right, right. Well, never mind, Paimon. But Lumi is pretty agile too. Yeah, Paimon is flying. So. Oh, you have that the type of doggos as well. Hey there, mate. From a distance, I guess. <laughs> okay, that didn't work. Will she stop or will she actually go? She stopped. God damn it. Move it, princess. And you, prince. Move it. Move it. Move it, move it, move it. Move it, move it, move it. Alright, I'll see you later. He said they were... What was that? Why did the fight trigger for a second? Weird. Uh, he said North, right? Oh, it is actually. 
wait. Oh, the final location is shown. Got it. Okay, I think I see... Hello. Go home. Move it, move it, hero. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Faster, faster, faster. You need to be faster. No, no, this way. Come on. The this way, you punk. Look at this punk, yeah. like, can you like go straight to the location? Who knew they'd be so capricious? Yeah. In a way. Well then, children, I hope you now understand that the more capricious they are, the more we need to teach them the rules. Well, we at least remembered not to tread on the flowers. Looks like we need a few rules laid down just for you, Paimon. Hey! Come on, Paimon's not like that! Nor is she some kind of dizzy bit of pet! Hey, well, if you're tired to rest here, a while before going, come have some of these tosses regard I just made while you're at it. Oh, goodies! But, oh, we shouldn't, we shouldn't, this doesn't sound right. Come on, do you not trust my skills? I would not speak for other dishes, but I am very confident in my regard, at least. No, no, I what if this would count as not following the rules or something. Labor deserves reward. This is what you are owed for your efforts. You need to eat to keep your strength up, after all. And you're adventurers. So we need that energy all the more. As for repairment of the official commission, I'll give it to you later. I believe the gu guild's rules indicate as much. Hey, hey, do you his don't mind if we do? Uh, enjoy your rug out, masterpiece, wiping your fatigue. A meal after someone's work uh, always tastes especially great. And the rug out was, well, it had a real homey feel, hey? Well, the ingredients and methods of cooking were nothing quite curious. Yep, it was normal, but tastes really good. Of course, even my silly daughter has not but praises for this dish. Just a whiff of it would send her running to the table, putting all her complaints inside. But she's very far away now, and I fear she can't spell my rug out any longer. I'd wager that she's forgotten the way home, in fact. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm sure if you don't mind telling us what she looks like, we could find her for you. We're good at that, remember? Yeah, if we meet her in our travels, that is. Oh, it really are great, good-hearted children. Thank you. In truth, it would not be hard for me to find her. She'd get someone to send me some letters previously. But I reckon she doesn't think she's at fault. Why else would she only send letters but not read her home? As such, I haven't read a single one of her letters. In fact, I haven't opened a single one. We can overlook the folly of animals, but are we to accept that from a human? A grown woman, no less. Speaking of which, she hasn't sent any letters recently. Perhaps she's finally grown tired of trying to get her eyes out of me. I mean, she's waiting for your reply, dude. Regardless, she not hire people says figure to bring her back. She can either admit fault and return herself or not at all. Okay, I mean, if you say so. At the same, thank you for helping to bring Hiro and the others back. The payment isn't much, but even with the rug out died ad added in, so take both, would you? You adventurers often sleep on the wild iron, don't you? Well, remember to eat well and dress warmly. Don't stare for catch a chill. Yep, take care of your leg too, Ersho. See you, take good care of yourselves. You could tell us her name at least. Oh, it's a recipe, nice. Recipe, recipe, recipe. And two steps fontaine take two steps further towards beauty. That's from the previous quest. Okay, do we try diving? For quest, or do we go to Court de Fontaine?
Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe we'll go. Fine, let's go to the court. Let's go to the court. Where is this thing? Um like somewhere in here, it seems like. Okay, we might not be able to get to this one. Because it seems like it's like, oh, you need to complete this world quest, this, 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 and this. And wait five days. Or something. Um, it seems like it's next to here. Yeah, it should be here. Okay, this one is not around. The next one somewhere in here which I don't know if it means inside higher or what seems like inside funny how the same person seems like made the the marks on the interactive map and it's all Arlecino, Arlecino sitting on her throne mm. okay seems like our people are not here Are you fucking kidding me? It requires Garcia's Pion completed. Why? Why a quest from a different area? Fuck! And that is a freaking daily quest, by the way, which is such a sh Why does it have to be the shitty world quest? I mean daily quest that pops up randomly. God damn it! Why would you do something like that again? Mehoyo, what? Why would you do that? Why do you want us to suffer like that? <laughs> All right, over here are like four quests, supposedly. I don't know if this will work for... I think I cannot. Uh, were you talking to me? Sorry, I didn't see you there. Tales of Humanity... Da, da, da. I did talk to her before, by the way. So, obviously you unlock like the... Uh, fighting quest and the whatever quests over here. That you can do every week. But seems like I can't do that yet. Okay, um, hmm, might as well go he All right, there is one over here. Virgil. Virgil. Inside the building. Let's see if I can enter inside of this building. Not the quest. Yes, I can. Apparently I can. Ok. 
Okay. Hello. I've never been here inside of this building now that I think about it. Huh. Pretty fancy as everything in Fontaine. Digging that. Cornelia. Eunomia. That seems like the people supposedly who'd Imena so who'd have quests for us. Sidine could have quests for us, I'm not know. Right? I'm correct in thinking that. Yeah, that's some guy next to Cornelia. And the other one is uh, a Melusine standing somewhere in the corner. And we don't have them around. So I guess that is out of the question now. Let's have a look of the over here. Talk to Estelle. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's the crafting lady, and by crafting I mean forging. Hello. Let's see if this will trigger anything. Nope. About the prophecy. Nothing. Let's see. Semi automatic. Semi automatic. Semi. I don't think I've done this. Complete chapter 4, Act 1. Oh. <laughs> You're right. Okay, there is a lot of stuff for some reason over here. And by over here, I mean right here. What's this building? Or this building? Is it like... Something important? Leroy... Leroy... Oh, inside... On the left side. Can I enter? Nope. Hmm... World quest... Leroy... Some guy, some girl, some girl and a guy, some girl. And like behind the house? Hello, Nana. Hmm. Should I skip to skip, skip, skip to the like proper day hour? Let's see. <sighs> nope, nothing. All right, I mean, pff, fine. Let's go here then. We have someone to visit. Hello, oh yeah, I have all of them. Haha. <laughs> huh. Dispatch character. Wait, what? Oof, I thought for a second they were not dispatched. <laughs> 
We meet again, Catherine. Hello there. The pleasure is all mine. I'm Catherine, the receptionist of the Avengers Guild. My job is to provide adventures with quests and intelligence support. May my services be of help to you, and may your journey from day be a marble one. Wait, what? Are you also a clockwork puppet, Catherine? Ahaha, <laughs> I wonder. Do I appear like a masterpiece of the Fontaine Research Institute to Sam? Wait, shouldn't you have a quest? I think she should have a quest. Did I tr Did I trigger it at some point? Talk to Catherine to unlock, unlock commissions in Fontaine. I mean, I think this means I have commissions, right? Or do I not have commissions? I don't know. Let's see if I do this. Commissions. Do we... No, no. This. Monstantly where Inazuma Sumeru. I probably can't get them yet, right? When... Can I unlock commissions in Fontaine? You must complete two new Archon quests. Okay, so this is not unlocked yet, basically. Gotcha. But what we have unlocked is over here. So we'll deal with this stuff. Virgil. <sighs> okay, Virgil, what do you want, you punk? I must say the weather today is simply wonderful. You are quite beautiful, the young lady. Virgil at your service. I'm pleasure to make your acquaintance. Lumina at your service. I'm Lumina, my companion is called Paimon. Let's go, second option. Hello, Virgil. Oh, such elegant names. Welcome to the court of Fontaine. It's truly honor to meet the two of you here. Ugh. Paimon can't set much more of this. How do you know we are not from Fontaine? Clothes? Hey, <laughs> with a glance it is obvious that you're uncivil... <gasps> Dude, you wanted to say uncivilized? Dude, you're from France. Fuck you. Everyone knows that it's the French who are a complete zero civilization. Even more so considering who you let into your own country, goddammit. Come on. France is becoming a wasteland, basically. Uh -huh. <clears throat> yeah. That you're unsatisfied with being bathed in soft lights of the city, but feel the call of the wild, which will never be eliminated by bright city lights. Yes, just like the heroes in the operas. Yeah, that's totally true. Lumina is adventure too. Adastra Besos can't all of that jazz. Yeah, I knew it. Those adventurers guild are beggarly. Beggarly? Courageous warriors begging with all their heart to unlock the deepest mysteries of the world. They wake with their eyes to the stars above and sleep with their backs to the abyss below. Where there is an unknown domain, there is an adventurer who simply must explore the bravery bursting beyond the brim. Yes. I could not help but notice how your gaze is focused on many things. Perhaps you wish to study our sublime arts, or our intricate clockwork mech, our advanced civic culture. Man, it's okay, I guess. Amazing! Paimon didn't notice the decorations, but Paimon did notice that Fontaine has its own delicious foods that she's never seen anywhere else. Not bad, isn't it? We have a long and glorious tradition of gourmet culture in Fontaine. Naturally, the few must often take your meals in the great outdoors, and those are unfortunately limited in your ability to sample the breaths of Fontaine's super cuisine, unable to experience the luxurious richness that is largely after tea with its pastries. Yeah, I've had more of a chance to sample cuisine than you'd think, you punk. Let's go back on 
topic. My mom thinks that Virgil has a commission for us. Oh, most excellent. My two exceptional friends. Have you heard of the name Lila Crucus Treasure? No. Nope, I haven't heard of it. Then please allow me to explain. This legend of a lost treasure has been passed down in Fontaine for centuries. Once there was a secret society called La Cruces Forum that was able to attract a great many of the rich and influential. For they humbly called themselves a forum. Their actual plan was to overthrow Fontaine itself. In the end, their conspiracy was exposed. And the, <coughs> the distinguished members of the forum engaged in a thrilling battle with the Maison Gardinage. But were ultimately defeated in a climatic showdown. Why do I feel like it was anticlimatic? However, my dear friends, you must know that they were once the richest and most famous of all Fontaine. And they must gather a tremendous amount of wealth. Yeah, yeah, they definitely did. And they must have a la huge treasure vault somewhere. And when you open it, wah! it's overflowing with nothing but gold shining like the sun. Correct. They wish to overthrow our people for ten, and to do so, they must have amassed a fortune so vast that they could literally be said to have more money than Morax. I mean, maybe the current Morax, yeah. However, this wealth was never found. Hehe, <laughs> so that means that as long as we can find the Lacrucius treasure, we'll also be filthy rich! Excellent deduction. My dear Paimon, with the fortune in control of Sinti. Ahem. <clears throat> Anyway, after a lengthy investigation, I've discovered the location of the Lila Cruz... Lila Cruces Forum's headquarters. It came found amidst the underwater ruins outside the city. <gasps> we are getting the... Uh, we are getting the... Access to the place I wanted to, I think. Really? Oh, what do you think, my dear Paimon? Lumine, I have sincerely extend my invitation to both of you to become my partners and dive under beneath the waves to search for the lost treasure. Even for the days, wait, water is different from elsewhere. My mom can never forget how she was drowning before being rescued by you. Never fear, I am here. Yeah, you'll save my mom again for sure, hey? It's settled then. If that's settled, please allow me to prepare diving equipment for two of you. Uh, I mean, I should have correct sizes. There is no need. Oh, oh yeah, I remember. Vision holders may dive freely in our waters, but if it's you, dear Lumine, yeah, he, she doesn't have, but... Of course, I do not adapt to her abilities to me in his fame adventure, and she must be very aware of her limits, and... But just so bad that I do not share the same capabilities, so I'll have to rely on our homegrown technology to keep myself alive. Be that as may, shall we begin? Yes. Lead the way! Your wish is my command. Please follow me. Our destination is not far from the court of Fontaine. <laughs> Wow, it looks so heavy and so hot and stuffy! Actually, you can place mist flowers wrapped in cloth inside lower the temperature. As for the wave, well, just put it underwater. There is no time to delay. Let's go, my friends. Delicious. In a way, I'm surprised nobody has found all of that stuff here. Oh. Yeah, I've been... I've been here before, but... Explore the former side of the place. Got it. I 
I did get here, but I don't remember why I didn't collect stuff at this place, at least. I know I can't enter to certain, like, locations, sort of. Um, I mean, I guess we might as well have a look around, right? Ancient key found, by the way. I feel like I needed an ancient key for something, but I do not remember what exactly it was. that something decided to attack me there. Why are you picking a fight with us, huh? What's, what's that supposed to mean? Whoops. I messed up a little bit. That's what you get. You didn't stand a chance. In this battle. Absolutely not feeling sorry about that myself. Hmm. Is there more levels here? Okay. That explains a little bit then. Um is this the quest? Aquarius tide marks. Okay. So this Virgil Neil the statue. I wouldn't be surprised if it is the same thing. Alright, what do you want from me, game? <laughs> Who's I kind of drifted off. Uh, I guess we have to go here, right? Why did the game explain to me how to use that power? I mean, come on. I know how to use it by now. Ooh, we need a different one now. This one will do, yeah. I would rather have the explosive one, but well, whatever. This will work too. This will work too. Oh yeah, I need an ancient key for this one, that's true. I did get over here. But I did not have the key at the time. Ooh. Nothing much, nothing much. Hi there. Ooh, I did not expect this guy. You're finished. Exquisite chat.
All right. Let us go further. I'm surprised this is not shooting at us. doing that for yeah ah, whatever not like it matters Ooh. why is this one over here whoa why is this Sumeru desert stuff over here what the hell that is suspicious And surprising in a way. <laughs> Ooh, there is a lot of those now. Fuck. But it's right underneath, so. The percent probably went up a little bit. Yeah, 98 now. Nice. needed to be honest mm -hmm. I'd say this one I'd say it was this one heard something popping again and I know there is one more somewhere close but <clears throat> not sure exactly where also yes I'm um, you know in case someone doesn't know by now interactive map going hard fuck this one maybe Hmm, is that about you? That thing shouldn't be like right above. Right above, I would say. There we go. Listen, I've seen it on an interactive map, so. I had to eventually, I guess. Boop. It's so nice to have a teleport waypoint unlocked another one.
five left to go in Fontaine. I don't know about treasures being around. And so on. But, well, maybe there will be something. Enigmatic page 4. Oh yeah! We can go back to solving stuff. Let's go. A certain... in a certain area. Uh, books. 4. Oh, there is supposedly more over here. Let's go. Let's freaking go. How will we open the door and proceed onward, I wonder? Oh, so this is the forum you were talking about? There are so many books everywhere. They must really have been dedicated to studying and conducting research. My mom would never have guessed that they were a secret society plotting to overthrow the government of Fontaine. As the saying goes, dear Paimon, knowledge is power. This is felt truth of the Lila Crisis Forum. You should understand that with great knowledge comes great power. And once great power is yours to command, there will only be one path left to you. Ah. <sighs> Paimon doesn't think that logic really holds water, but you're the local, not Paimon. So Paimon will trust you know what you're talking about and leave it at that. They seem to have been researching some amazing things. Fo, and you've already seen plenty of stuff that obviously isn't from here on the way. These things are pretty annoying. Last time we saw them was in the summer deserts of La... Uh, yeah. Well, knowing their extensive resources, it couldn't have been too hard for them to get their hands on these kinds of things. After all, this is the fabulously wealthy Lacrosis forum we are talking about here. Hey, but we've also explored a lot of domains and seen more than our fair share of cool things during our adventures. Is that so? Then I presume we've also found a lot of treasures. You presume correctly? How fascinating. I mean, what a terrific achievement. I expected nothing less from the two of you. It's too bad that this place is completely flooded. It really feels like a lot happened here and they made a lot of important discoveries. The water levels of Fontaine have risen before, and according to the folks at the Fontaine Research Institute, they will rise again in the future. Perhaps one day all of Fontaine will disappear beneath the waves. Hopefully not. What? Wow, that'd be terrible. All the delicious food drowned and lost forever? Anyway, let's hope nothing like that will have happened in the future. The future? Who cares about that? I'll be that long before then, so why should I worry about the people alive then? What do the people on Fontaine of the future have to do with me? I mean, it, it's both bad and good thinking, I kind of understand. I would pay my respects to my family and friends. After all, they raised me and have done many things for me. But have the people of the future done anything for you? For me? So what do we owe them? Isn't it right? Nah. Pretty extreme. 
Um, that's what I might have said about the issue of floating. If I liked both patriotism and sex of civic responsibility. Pretty abominable. Anyway, sorry for digressing. There should be a way to open the door below. Let's take a look around to see if there are any clues or keys. I also try to see if I can find anything in the associated files, my dear friends. Oh yeah, I have not looked if maybe it's super high. Nah. Nothing. Oh. Oh. Hello there. So I need you to smack you. I will need you. To smack you. Okay. Brilliant! Now we can continue further in the Institute's deaths, as expected of a seasoned adventurer. Eh, aren't we investigating the forum? So, is the forum or an institute? Ah, sorry, I misspoke. I forgive me for asking this out of blue, but did either of you ever run into anyone who was looking for me? Or did you tell anyone else about our encounter? Dude, when? We literally encountered you and went here immediately after. Come on. Eh, Paimon doesn't think so. What's wrong, Veggie? Do you owe someone a ton of mora? <laughs> no, of course not. It just occurred to me that I should let you know that there are many greedy goons who are also after the La Cruces forum secret treasure. They were different from us. They wouldn't do anything to achieve their goals. So I always refuse to work with them, as I know the most about the treasure's whereabouts. They have me in their sights. I spent a long time hiding from their prying eyes and looking for my partners. I can trust. It is my luck to have finally met you two, my dearest friends. I don't trust this guy. Hey, so that's what's going on. In a case, I'm just relieved to hear that you never told anyone else about me. That's, that's suspicious. Phew. I just know I picked the right people to be my partners. Only your best friends can be relied on to keep your secrets. Yeah, yeah, don't worry, Belgium. We won't tell anyone else about you. <laughs> I have complete confidence that you will never ever tell anyone another soul about me. Let's go, the treasure is waiting for us. Yeah, yeah, here we come, treasure! Dude, the way he worded this, it's pretty obvious he's going to be the... You know... <laughs> enemy of ours, basically. Basically, here we go again. <laughs> Not the first time that happened. Oh, it must be up. Got it. Uh, I wanted to have a look at... I wonder, by the way, if we'll manage to get all the 4-star weapons from that event. Would be cool. Would be really cool. I don't even r really know what the weapons were, but it would be nice to have them. It would be nice to have them. Also, that enigmatic page, I would like to have a look at it. Four, uh, seven, nine, twelve, thirteen. Hmm. We are lacking quite a few. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, but not sorry. Hmm. 
Now, which one is it? I think this one. Lend me your strength. Huh. Yeah. So this must be the other one on this side. I got it. I've got quite a bit of more out of this quest by now. That's great. Okay, I probably would like to break this stuff. Alright, it's probably the one where you need to cut through both of them at the same time again. Oh, it's a challenge! Um, give me a second with that. Ended one right here. Cool. Um, time trial. Where are we supposed to go from here? Quest a site. Oh, probably here, right? Yeah. Alright, give me the... this one. I've succeeded. Haha. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> Defeat the clockwork mecha, I was just saying. Fine. Uh, what do I need? Use the key. I don't specify what key. That's... A little problematic. Good heavens, let me yourself give away with the mecha. Phew, we are getting close to the treasure. After all, we've already run into the guards. Hmm. For Fontaine's achievements are as numerous and dazzling as the stars in the sky. The clock or mecha are undoubtedly the most exquisite of them all. For plus, I should never praise one of the most exquisite. You must have traveled via Aquabus when you visited the court, correct? Tell me, you've seen the intricate steam beard as well. In Fontaine, even blacksmithing is done by mecha. Why? The Maison Gardinage didn't even have to lift a finger to beat me up. They just sent out some guard mechs. It hurt so much, there was no choice but to submit. Beat you up? I mean, beat up the bad guys. Why would they ever beat me up? Wow, if Mecha Radio so advanced, then surely the people of Fontaine don't need to do anything for themselves anymore and can just leave everything to machines. <laughs> That's a good one. 
Ah, my dear friend, you're just adorable. It's a lot cheaper to hire a human than buy a clockwork mecha. Or to put it another way, no one and nothing can infringe on a Fontaine citizen's right to work. Okay. Paimon, why don't you show him that trick of yours again? Ah, beep! Construct! Beep! Oh, ho, 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 ho. So fascinating. In any case, though, I think everyone would agree that humans and machines are not the same. True. What's that sound? For all the places we've been have their own charm too. It's not like Fontaine is just better than everyone else, right? My friend surely cannot be serious. How can there be a place in Teva that's better than Fontaine? I like Inazuma more still. Looks beautiful, Fontaine. Swimming awesome. But I you you know, I don't know. I like yeah, it's always Inazuma. Dude, Japan for the win. Ah, I was just trying to say that the other places are also really special too, Virgil. Have you ever set foot outside of Fontaine, you punk? My dearest Paimon, you should know that there is an old saying in Fontaine. All waters lead to Fontaine. It, it's not the people of Fontaine who should go out and see the world, but not the world who should come and witness Fontaine's glory. Don't get it backwards. Do people really say that? Come on, man. Of course they do. Anyway, my friends, why don't we keep going? The treasure is still waiting for us deep inside the ruins. Yeah, yeah, let's go, Lumina. Honestly, how do they not see him as being suspicious? Like, the guy is a, basically a walking sign of suspiciousness. No more. I take you and I smack you. Yeah. Then I take you and smack you. Not gonna lie, I mean I don't have those items maxed out, unfortunately now. But when I had Berserk uh, 3 stars or 4 stars on Lumina, she was so much stronger. <laughs> it's kinda funny. It was also a very long time ago. Okay, so there was a common chest. I wonder if this is what it will now be. No. Hmm. Elemental time torch mini puzzle? No. Oh, that's that this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The last Pneumosia mechanism completed. 41 out of 41, let's go. And we also go straight for the Silly over here, which will also be the last one in Fontaine. Woo! Let's go. Where are you going up? 
What? Why did it go up? What the f What? Does it even work? Oh, what we get squished for? I mean, there is a rooftop, dude. Oh, there isn't a rooftop now. What the hell? Whatever. Nice call music. Now. <sighs> right, silly, lead the way. Hmm. Lead the way, silly. Wait for me. An exquisite chest, almost always basically very welcome. Very, very welcome. Hmm. Let's go, Seely. Lead the way still. <laughs> Are we going underwater, Seely? Okay. Ooh. Oh, right. I'm down. I did not realize it was where we came from. Hmm. I mean, I guess I would like to do the challenge, right? It doesn't look like there is anything else around. That's it. It's probably something kind of easy again. Ah, oh, that's it? Dude, that's the challenge? Give me more of them. <laughs> that's hilarious. Yeah, let's try one bullet bar knuckle. Okay. I mean, I'm not complaining. Again, give me more of that. More of those. <laughs> that silly had a long path, by the way. Also, why the fuck did my phone reset now? What's that supposed to be? Why? Yeah, cool, but why did you reset yourself, you punk? What's that supposed to be? Dude, that's so suspicious now. I don't like it in the slightest. No idea. Ancient report. Oh, that was a short one. We could have you read this, whatever.
Okay, that's weird. Why is it not falling? Why are you not falling down, man? Font of all waters. Hmm. You know what? I know it's a terrible move, but oh, hundred percent! Yee! Hundred, 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 hundred. Only Lefe region is left. That's not hundred yet. Um, alright, I, I mean, I unlocked the waypoint, so... We'll do the usual, kind of. Kind of the usual. <laughs> and that's our achievement, 953. <laughs> 953 34 huh 10 more or should I go here I like Yelan so much more I mean obviously Fine. One last ten on her and we are done. Oh shit. Oh snap. Oh snap. <laughs> ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、
And of course, we also landed another 5 star. I must might as well. Ah, might as well. Ah, you know, might as well a little bit. Beginner's Protector. I mean, I know we have Favonius Lance here, but uh, I'm gonna do this, obviously, as always. That's Polish name, by the way. Adios. <laughs> The name was basically saying hello, but in a kind of slang way, in case you didn't know. Dun, 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 dun. I have Favonius Lance and I have Dragon's Bane. I don't think Dragon's Bane will be for her. Maybe Favonius Lance... I will need to do a research. For now she stays like this. Right. What do you want from me, game? Oh. Thank you. I have only three for. Only three. Ah, twenty. Twenty-seven. Damn it. Seven lacking man. That's a shame. I would like to get more Noel. I would like to. Well, won't be surprised if she will be in a banner, one of the banners at least, when not land characters will be around. I kind of hope for that as well. Kind of hope for that. Um, I guess we'll be continuing on the next stream, maybe tomorrow. Do with the world quests, uh, for maybe we'll sit to Zenless on a stream. I don't know yet. We will see. I know that we'll not be able to catch up to go to Natlan immediately, because obviously Archon quests. Obviously, characters, quests, and so on. I will not be in a rush, as per usual. I'm that star type of persona, after all. But we will finish it for today. I will play you some music and we'll be going away. We'll be going away. Let's play some Dansu. First win. I wonder if it's good. It's better hero. Now it's sort of decent. In case you want more content, I guess that's to VOD watchers in the chat. The YouTube is dropped, you can technically find it on Twitch profile as well. And we are approaching the end of If My Heart Had Wings on YouTube. There will be... let me see so quickly. There will be three more episodes. Saturday, Sunday, Monday. And on Monday also planning to start Sakura Sakudus 9, which releases on that day. Uh, and then we'll see. Who knows? More games, more games, and more games. Ah. Alright, let's end for today. I wish you all a wonderful weekend and and I wish you a wonderful weekend to be fair, that's all already. Have fun and stay safe. Stuff like that.